Ever wonder how the Russian Mil Mi-28 attack helicopter, a marvel of modern engineering comes to life? Today, we delve into the fascinating journey of its production, from blueprint to battlefield. Imagine a sheet of blank paper. This is where it all begins. The Mil Moscow helicopter plant, Russia's premier chopper manufacturer, starts with a conceptual design. Engineers and designers meticulously draft every detail, every curve, every bolt of the Mi-28. This stage, often lasting several months, involves rigorous calculations, simulations, and design revisions to ensure optimal performance. Once the design gets a green light, it's time for the physical creation. This is where raw materials like titanium, steel, and aluminum transform into the formidable body of the Mi-28. Using high-precision machinery, workers cut, shape, and assemble the helicopter's various components. The fuselage, the rotors, the landing gear, each piece is built with an almost obsessive attention to detail. Next up is the power plant. The Mi-28 is powered by two TV3117 VMA turboshaft engines, each producing over 2,200 horsepower. These powerhouses give the chopper its impressive speed of over 300 kilometers per hour and a flight ceiling of five and a half kilometers. The installation of these engines, along with the transmission systems, marks the end of the assembly stage. But the Mi-28 is far from ready. Now it's time to arm this beast. The Mi-28 boasts an impressive arsenal. It features a movable chin-mounted 30mm Shapunov 2A42 autocannon. It can carry a variety of missiles from anti-tank guided missiles to unguided rockets. It's a flying fortress designed to intimidate and decimate. Finally, the helicopter undergoes rigorous testing. Every system, every component, is pushed to its limits to ensure it can handle the harshest of conditions. Only after surviving these trials does the Mi-28 earn its place in the skies. But what makes the Mi-28 truly stand out is its advanced technology and defense systems. It features an integrated electronic warfare suite and radar-absorbing coatings, making it difficult to detect. It also has advanced navigation systems and a helmet-mounted display for the pilot, giving it an edge in modern warfare. So to recap, the journey of the Mi-28 starts with a detailed design process, followed by the transformation of raw materials into the helicopter's body. The power plant featuring two powerful engines is installed next. The chopper is then armed with a variety of weapons and finally put through a series of rigorous tests. The Mi-28's advanced technology and defense systems set it apart from its counterparts, making it a formidable force in the skies. That's the story of the Mi-28 a testament to human ingenuity and the pursuit of technological excellence, a marvel that begins its life on a simple sheet of paper and ends up ruling the skies.